Start to screw the ball back, side, everything. Uh, great little touch. He, it doesn't seem like he, he's lacking anything at all yet. Inspiration? Well, the whiz kid puts that down to 12-year-old brother Robert, who is also in the under-16 team, and that old second-hand mini pool table where it all began. My mum and dad went down the shop on the left road down there and, and she bought a pool table. And when they come back, they put it up and I, I practice on it. If you want to be the best, then you have to play with the best. No better way then than to rack them up against the best in the world. Rob McKenna may be two times world champion, but there's no mercy when Perry's on cue. And finally to the television of the future. Scientists in Cambridge have developed the world's first plastic TV. It's just two millimetres thick and uses glowing plastic to transmit pictures. Although they're only black and green at the moment, the full colour version isn't far behind. What's more, unlike small TVs, you can view this screen from every angle without the quality of the pictures being affected. Scientists realised they could make these TVs by accident when they noticed that a certain kind of plastic glows under ultraviolet light. The first product to be made will be a screen for displaying information on mobile phones. The first plastic TVs could be on sale within the next 10 years. And that's it for today. Join us again tomorrow, live at 5. Bye bye. bye. If you want to get the lowdown on where's best to hang out, 